Social Security Administration Officer Spencer, her message to today. I don't know. I get a message to call this number, something wrong with my Social Security number, legal action or something. I, I don't know. Could you help me out with the first and the last name? First name is Oscar, O-S-C-A-R. Last name, the Grouch, D-A-G-R-O-U-C-H. O-U-C-H, okay, the Grouch. Oscar, Oscar the Grouch, yes. Okay, the Grouch. All right, uh, and for security reasons, could you help me out with your social security number so that I would be able to pull up your case file from my system? Yes, 0861014463. All right, and could you confirm me your date of birth? 3-16-50. 3-16-50, is that correct? Yes. All right, let me pull up your case file from my system and I'll get you the details. Kindly hold on the line for the next couple of seconds. Okay. Thank you so much. Thanks for your time and patience, Oscar. Yes. Now, could you grab a piece of a paper and a pen handy for yourself? Uh, all right, go ahead. Okay, first of all, I want you to make a note of your case file ID number. Case of what? I don't know what it's about. I'll, I'll let you know. I'll let you know each and everything. Have patience, okay? Okay. Let us go step by step. Yeah. Step by okay. step. First okay, first of all, I want you to... Yep. Okay. Yep. So, yep. probably, I want you to make a note of your case yes. file ID number. That is D for David, C for Charlie. DC. Yes. 4673. Okay. Now you can note down my badge ID number for your future reference. Okay. That is 21079. Okay. All right. Could you repeat me the details that you made a note of? What details? I don't know anything about it. No. Could you repeat me the details that you made a note of? You didn't give me any details yet. You gave me your badge number and my case number. Is that yes, what you want? That's what, that's, yes, that's what I DC want. DC 4673, 21079. Mm -hmm. Absolutely perfect. Okay. Yeah, okay, good. Now, let me go forward. Now, the reason yeah, that you okay. were contacted today mm -hmm. was to inform you regarding some legal enforcement actions filed on your social security. As we have got an order to suspend your social security number at this right moment. Suspend it? For what? Yes. How can you suspend okay. it? That's what I get, social security. I'm 69 years old. Let me complete out the legal affidavit first. Well, okay. And then I'll well, give you all the okay. information. Okay, go ahead. Go ahead. Okay. Now, your social security number has been found suspicious for criminal activities in the state of Texas. So, have you ever been to the state of Texas before? Texas? No. Okay. Now, Oscar, the investigation started when we found an abandoned car on the south border of Texas. And the it's car not mine. I'm some... in New York. I'm in New York. So, it's okay. not mine. Okay, let me first complete out the legal effort ever for you. I don't want you to interrupt me in between. Oh, wow, well, I'm sorry. Complete. Okay, go ahead. So now, as I was letting you know, now the investigation started when we found an abandoned car on the south border of Texas. I know that. And the yes. car contained some blood and drug residues inside it. Hence, after investigation, we found that the car was rented on your name and on your personal social information. Yeah. And there was two addresses linked with the title of vehicle. Okay. The address in the city of Rollet, which was raided by the U.S. Marshal, but unfortunately, there was no one inside the residence. But we have recovered 22 pounds of cocaine wow. and 16 pounds of heroin, which is an abuse heroin. of drugs. Heroin? Correct. What would I do with 16 pounds of heroin? Okay. And some documentation, such as, uh, you know, from the financial institute, such as Chase Bank, Bank of America, and U.S. Bank. And this entire paperwork has your name on it. And thousands of dollars has been wired from this bank accounts, locally and internationally, which totally seems suspicious to us. Now, that is the reason we as a Social Security Administration of the State of Texas has filed case against you for drug trafficking as well as money laundering. Well, how you, what are you basing that on? Have you got any proof it was me? I mean, it wasn't okay. me, so what proof do you have it was me? Yes. Now, we have a very strong evidence against you to prove you guilty. How can you have strong court. evidence for an Irene Bender? Okay. Now, we have cross-verified it from your social security number, wherein your personal identity was used. Okay, your social security number has been used 
for this criminal activities your personal name your personal details your date of birth has been used in renting okay. a car and everything okay yeah it's, it is yeah. under your name okay now as we are having a very short time and what you have you know what you have done was totally against the law i didn't do anything so Will you let me complete? Well, I'm, I'm telling it's you, I really, didn't do anything. What do you mean, let you complete? You're telling me I did this, I did that, I didn't do anything. That is what you're telling me, okay? Yeah, that's you what I'm telling you. <laughs> okay, but <laughs> we cannot trust anyone at this point of time in regards to this case, wherein this is very important information for you. So if you have patience, we'll proceed further. If not, I'll have to hang up this call further, and I'll have to execute this case file to my seniors, to my legal department, wherein you'll receive a call within the next 15 to 20 minutes. If it works in your favor, well and good. If not, you will have to bear the legal consequences under your name. I don't know what that means. So, do you want me to proceed further? Yeah, proceed. I'm getting you the orders. Please, please, okay. please proceed. Okay. So now, as this is a case for financial fraud and money laundering, we have to cancel, we have to suspend your social security number as soon as we hang up this line. Well, you can't which do means that. all okay which I means all that. of the bank accounts yes which means all of the bank accounts debit and credit and every account whatever you have with financial institutions will be get seized suspended or will spend be no longer spend? in use the social security administration they're going to spend now, it if you are suspended oh suspended okay correct now if you are receiving any government benefits Yes, I it am. I get Social Security. I told you that. Okay. So it will be on hold till the time result come out of your file. Now, according to Section 101, you are going to be taken to judicial custody for Section federal correction. Section 101 of what? 101 of what? Are you trying to, you know, just avoid the situation? It doesn't no, seem I'm that asking you, you Section 101 of what law? What Let law me, that, are you that's quoting? What, that's it. Okay. That is about a money laundering case as well as a drug trafficking case. The section is 101A. Okay? Of now what come law is what I'm asking you, sir? Sir, first, now I don't want you to interrupt me anyhow in between. Let me first complete the legal affidavit so at least you would have an idea what this call How is all about. How can I have an idea if you won't tell me what law you're quoting? Didn't I explain you at the very starting of the call that you don't have to interrupt me till the time I complete this legal affidavit? But you quoted a section of law which I never heard of, and I'm asking you what law mm -hmm. that section belongs to. There are many different laws, as you know, and I'm wondering what law that section belongs mm -hmm. to. That's not a hard question, sir. Okay, that's not a hard question, but whatever has been mentioned on the legal affidavit, I'm just reading it out for you. So first of all, let me complete that, and then I can answer all your questions that you have in your mind. Okay. okay. All right. So after that, your case will be taken to the courthouse for the money laundering as well as drug trafficking charges. Now, I'm done with your case paper. If you have any questions, you can go ahead and ask me now. Yes. Section yes. 101A of what law? Okay, just give me a moment. I'll get you each and everything. Let me answer each and every question of yours. Okay. It's kind of hard to defend myself when I don't know what law <laughs> I'm defending myself against. Okay. It is the Immigration and Nationality Act 101. Immigration? A. What you, immigration? Yes. I'm an American citizen. I was born here. Okay, but you have, you know, defaulted. Uh, you know, you know, you have committed a fraud. Uh, I never committed anything, to, and I'm a natural-born citizen. I, I don't understand what mm -hmm. immigration has to do with me. Okay. All right. So right now, we strictly have been instructed by the Social Security Administration Department to suspend your Social Security number, as well as we will have to freeze your bank account. Now, before we proceed with all the legal documentations, do you have any more questions for me? Apparently, I'm not going to get an answer, so no. All right. So not a problem. Further, your case file will be executed further to the legal department. Your Social Security number would be suspended right away, right now. 
Okay. And once you prove yourself genuine in front of the courthouse and, you know, fighting with the Social Security Administration Department. Why would I want to you fight with anyone? I didn't do anything. You didn't do anything? No, okay. I didn't do anything. So, all right. If you're pretty much sure about this case, not a problem. Further, let me, you know, let me forward this case file to my legal department and they'll get back to you very soon with the next 15 to 20 minutes. That would be the maximum time. Oh, I'm not going to sit around and wait for them to get a hold of me. So what are you going to do next? I don't know. I, I don't know what to do, but I got things to do. I can't be sitting around here waiting for them to call me back, that's for sure. Uh, they are certainly going to call you back. Well, I'm not going to be here. They can call back. I ain't going to be here. Uh, where are you heading towards? I'm heading towards Tim Hortons, where I work. I'm a master baker there. Okay. All right. So I can't talk to him now. Notification. I can't talk to him now. Uh, certainly not, because first I will have to send this case file in, you know, sending all your details to them about this legal affidavit, and then they can get your call back. They can't the call next... me back. I'm not going to be here, Ben Chod. Okay. So, all right, not a we, problem. What are so, we going to do now? Mm -hmm. What are we going to do now? Now, whatever procedures uh, have been set by the government, I'll have to work according to it. So, probably, I'll have to... Transfer this case file to my seniors. Okay, transfer me. Transfer me! No. The fuck, you deaf? Why are you yelling at me? Because I'm sick of this shit. I want to get this thing over with. I'm not sitting here waiting for somebody to call me back. They would certainly call you back. I'm not going to be here. Do you understand? I'm not going to be here. Any which ways you're going to, you know... Any which ways? Mm -hmm. What is the most important thing for you right now? I got to get to work at Tim Hortons where I'm a master baker. Okay. So, okay. Now, if you get arrested, would you be able to work in future? What if you get arrested? How am I going to get arrested if I didn't do anything? That is what you're letting me know. That's what I'm but telling you, But for the government yes. right now, yes. But right now right. for the government, you are the main culprit. I, I don't give a shit. I didn't do it. That is all up to you. No, it's all up to you. Are you going to connect me to somebody smarter than you or the boss? Let me talk to the boss. Sir, I'm the one who's handling your case today. Yeah, but I want to I'll talk to, to the head guy, the boss. Put me through to the boss. First of all, you'll have to calm yourself down. I, how can I calm down when you're going to cancel my Social Security? How can I calm down? My blood pressure is probably higher than ever now. Okay. Let me talk to calm somebody. Well, yeah, let me talk to the, higher, the guy higher let than me. you. Okay, let me schedule a call back within the next two I'm minutes. I'm not going to be here, stupid! Within 30 seconds? I'm not going to be here. I'm on the way out the fucking door, numbnuts. Do you understand that this is a federally recorded line? You Do you understand that I know you're a scamming bastard? Do you understand that? <laughs> you fuck.